West Concord has a lot going on this weekend with survival days taking place Thursday through Sunday. This morning, a 5K was hosted in honor of a 15 month old that died unexpectedly back in February of 2022. ABC 6 News reporter Theodore Tollefson spoke to the family and has the story. The Rizloff family lost their youngest daughter, LeMay, on February 23rd, 2022, due to unexpected circumstances. In honor of her memory and to raise awareness in partnership with the sudden and unexpected death in childhood, they've started LeMay's Bright Light 5K this year. The loss of a daughter, a niece, and a sister who was only 15 months old hit the family very hard. Nick Houtvik is a brother-in-law to both Allison and Jacob Rizloff and was the one who found out about SUDC for the family. Once connected, he inquired about running in the New York City Marathon to represent LeMay and the rest of the family. My boss down at MnDOT here uh, introduced me to another family that was going through the same thing and they got us connected with this SUDC and things kind of just kept rolling and eventually I got into the marathon. and. Following Nick's participation in the New York City Marathon, the Rizloffs organized a 5K of their own for LeMay. The 5K on Saturday brought together many friends and family of the Rizloffs that participated, like the Blazvik family who went to high school with Allison and Jacob in Dodge Center. We love the idea of being here to come and support and show our love because friends and family are the most important things in our life. So we, we're honored that they would have this and invite us to come do it. Seeing old friends like the Blasvix and many more come together in their support means the world to the Rizvox. Super overwhelmed um, with just gratefulness of all these people that showed up for her and showed support and just bringing awareness. Mm -hmm. It's just very overwhelmingly heartfelt. With all these people coming together to honor LeMay, it brings back many happy memories of her for her parents and sister. She wasn't walking yet. She would stand up. She took a step, get so excited, fall back down, get up again, try to take another step or two, fall back down, and then just take off crawling because it was so much faster. These memories of old and the new ones from the 5K gave the Rizlovs and everyone else so much to cheer for at the end. One, two, three. LeMay! Rizlov's raised around $6,500 in LeMay's 5K and will be doing half of it to Sudek and the other half to the Dodge County Sheriff's Department. They are hoping to make LeMay's Bright Light 5K an annual event moving forward. In West Concord, Theodore Tollefson, ABC6 News.